In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. May the peace of Jesus be with all of us. Brothers and sisters, once again I greet you in Jesus' name. My name is Umumara Rungu Marie Louise. I always come to you, my dear friends, because I have a heavenly message to you. Let us continue with this gospel according to Matthew chapter 24, verse 16. Let us pray for our today's bread. Jesus, my Savior, I thank you for this day. You bless us because we wake up alive and we are planning to do many, many things today. We pray for our peace and our joy, our success today. Jesus, we know you are the fulfillment of the promises of God. Jesus, protect us and help us to be your disciples, especially to give to those who are surrounding us the good example with our good actions. Jesus, I pray in your name. Amen. Brothers and sisters, we continue talking about the awful hero. Let us read. Then those who are in Judea must run away to the hills. Someone who is on the roof of his house must not take the time to go down and get his belongings from the house. Someone who is in the field must not go back to the to get his crook. Let us stop by here, the, the gospel of Jesus. We stop by here because we don't want to rush. We go slowly by slowly. The most important is to understand, to get the meaning of what is written. Because most of us are dying like children who are poor. When our mother, the Bible, the church is so, so, so rich. Because we read, we only read like we are reading like a newspaper. We don't take our time to meditate. Maybe Jesus has sent me to you to help you to meditate. Hallelujah. Because through the meditation, you will know many, many things. Don't forget. The disciples came to Jesus in private hallelujah in private and they asked him um, about what will happen jesus is explaining to them means they are still in the that private private place that is why when you want to know more about the kingdom of heaven, you have to go to the to to go to in that privacy with Jesus, Hallelujah, and ask Him. He will explain to you everything, Hallelujah. Brothers and sisters, don't be ignorant. Let us be with the Holy Spirit who is explaining everything as Jesus told us. He will explain you everything I taught you. That is what Jesus told us before he went. 
Man, those who are in Judea must run away to the hills. Someone who is in the roof of his house must not take his time to go th down and get his belongings from the house. It means that when someone becomes bad, you no longer have a, you have not to have a relationship with him because he became so bad. He became a destroyer. That is how to run away. This is someone who is in, the, uh, uh, in Judea must run away to the hills. Hills means something which is up. That is a hill. Up means if you find someone in a sin. This is the first explanation. Hallelujah. Someone when he is in a sin means he is down. And when someone uh, works from the kingdom of heaven, for us we, we say he is up. And when someone is doing bad, we say we say he is down. He fall he falls down. Means he became from the the roof the top to the ground to the down. He's no longer someone to not to touch because he became down. So to, de dif to be different from him is to go up to the hill. Hill here, it's like a sign which is um, showing us how to go far from him down in the hills means when someone is in the valley that that is down up to the hill is no, totally different it means that someone is on the ground for you to be different from him to be different from a sinner you have to go to up the hill and someone who is on the roof of his house must not take the time to go down. You can see down and up. Means someone who is still uh, sent or holy must not come to be in sins. Because let us assume that I fall in uh, sins. I, like me, Marie Louise Momaranongo, I'm a preacher. And because of preaching, I try to be in Jesus' mode, Jesus', Jesus mode. I try to be in holiness so that what I tell you, I must be in what, I must be like a witness of that what I tell you. I try to be in holiness. And let, let us assume that yesterday, uh, tomorrow you meet me uh, in a prostitu prostitution. Then you will say, eh, Marie Louise was a preacher. Now she's a prostitute. Means she falls down from the top. She's down in a sins. Are you getting me, my dear friends? She was up. She was in preaching. Now she's down. She's in sins. She's down. The one who is my friend at the roof, that one who is a preacher like me, that one who is in a holiness of what I teach you, must not come down because I'm down. For him, he must keep the, you must keep continuing. I'm preaching you, but tomorrow I fell down. Don't, pre, for, don't fall down because I fell down, but keep continuing. That is what the Bible is saying. Then those who are someone who 
someone who is on the roof of his house that is your house because when i come to you i'm building your house i always tell you hallelujah i don't come with a new message my dear friends i don't come to preach to you for a new message no i come to you with a reminder and this is this i'm doing now it's not my own benefit no this is for your benefit and i tell you every time if you convert yourself don't even come to me to tell me that you have converted yourself no go to god and tell him i ha- i am already converted god forgive me don't come to marie louise and say marie louise do you know what i have converted myself i will tell you this is not mine go to god hallelujah amina this is your house on the roof of his house must know to take the time to go down and get his belongings from the house hallelujah you don't come to to take your things from what i bur- i was building to you i hope you understanding my dear friends means if someone who is a preacher if someone is a role model to you fall down don't follow him don't follow his step don't go with the, like him because for him he has his reason why and you you have to keep continuing keep growing hallelujah keep working for for the kingdom of heaven this is the meaning someone who is in the field must not go back to get his crook hallelujah to be in the field is what it is it is to cultivate you are cultivating you are doing something in your in, in your field means i preach and you go to preach also when i preach to you you can hear something from me and go to your friend to tell him or to tell her about what you learned from the audio if i fall down don't go back to your friend and tell them oh do you know what how i'm sorry what i i used to tell you is not true because the marriage is falls down no no and no because marriage is someone but the preaching the gospel is something else i can fall down but the gospel the bible will remain the same hallelujah it will remain holy i can explain the gospel when i'm a sinner and when you find me in this in the scene don't far for with me don't go with, with me and don't even go to your friend to tell them that you are in a wrong way means a wrong way is not the bible a wrong way is what i have followed even though i was a preacher i'm giving an example is not my intention to do so no 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 i i'm not i'm not with that bad intention of going back to you but and you will be regretting now just it is just an example to help you to understand what is uh, the by what the bible is saying and i hope you are understanding if your role model fall down don't follow him or her you rather help him to get up if he says no means she became or he became a child of the devil even though she was serving for the kingdom of heaven but she has changed the day way 
for you you keep continuing in a good way and God will reward you my dear friends don't fall down don't fall down keep going keep working for the kingdom of heaven and you will have your reward in the name of the father the son and the holy spirit amen